Sup sup everyone, it's really Timmy B and welcome to episode 5 of my Pokemon Platinum Randomized Santa Lock. Last episode, we took down Team Galactic in Eterna City, we got our bike, we hatched an egg into Metagross, we got a couple of encounters and we made it all the way to Heart Home City. Today, we're going to take on the Heart Home City Gym Leader, spin the gift wheel again, get some more encounters, and continue the game. We're not going to start off with the team recap this episode because Shane is one level away from evolving again. So we're going to start the episode with evolving Shane and then we uh, have a couple of Pokemon to decide who we want to put on the team. So team recap will come just shortly. I have Greta out front for Leaf Blade. That'll take it down. And Shane should... Okay, one more Pokemon for Shane to evolve. I believe when I checked it was about 250 away. So one more Pokemon should do it. Happini, what's up? Take this Leaf Blade, and Shane grew to level 21. It is time for Shane to evolve Shane. Please don't disappoint us again. Oh, okay. A Kadabra? Okay, okay, okay. I'm a fan, I'm a fan. Congratulations, your Shane evolved into Kadabra. It's actually not a bad Pokemon to have right now. Let's check out Shane's ability. And you have Levitate, gives full immunity to all ground type moves. That's actually really good because, look at that defense. You are pretty weak to physical attack, so ground could do some damage, but not anymore because we got Levitate. And we are back here in Heart Home City because in this building right next to the Pokemon Center, we get another Pokemon as a gift. If we talk to you, hiya, oh, you're a trainer. That means you're using Pokemon boxes. I love meeting end users. Oh, what's up? Why that astonished look? Oh, right, sorry. There I go running my mouth again. My name's Bebe. You know the Pokemon PC boxes? I'm the system administrator. I know this is out of the blue, but do you want a Pokemon named Eevee? It's definitely not gonna be an Eevee. Uh, so let's check out what it is. Uh, going on about Eevee, blah, blah, blah. We got the Eevee, hooray. Let's give a nickname to the Eevee and let's see what it is. We got a, yo! Yo, we got a Glaceon? Oh my God, this is awesome. Oh yeah, this is getting on the team. And who wants to be the ice? Ice Eevee, who wants to be Glaceon. All right, we are going to name the Glaceon Danny after DPG Games. Uh, he just commented on the previous Santa Lock uh, as I'm recording. So Danny, welcome to the team. You are a Glaceon. Let's check out your ability and your moves because that's this is awesome. And this helps with our weakness to grass and flying type. So Danny, let's see what you have. You often doze, often happily eats anything. You have Sand Veil, boost the Pokemon's evasion in a sandstorm. Okay, not, not the best, not the worst. And you have Ice Fang, Icy Wind, Rage, and Crush Claw. We can definitely make this work. So uh, let's, this is probably gonna be the team. So let's just hop into a team recap right now. We have Greta the Grottle with, uh, you like spicy food. You have Early Bird, awakens quickly from sleep with the moves. Stun Spore, Giga Drain, Leaf Blade, and Magical Leaf. Next up, we have Shane, the Kadabra who just evolved from Bellsprout, who evolved from a Shinx. With the moves, Cut, Magical Leaf, Thunderbolt, and Thunder Fang. With the ability, we already checked out the ability, but with Levitate, that's right. We have Manny, the Marowak, our starter with Hyper Cutter, prevents the attack stat from being lowered. With the moves Magnitude, Earthquake, Judgment, and Rock Smash. Next up, we have Tammy the Tentacool with Water Pulse, Aqua Tail, Fury Attack, and Sludge. With the ability Magic Guard, the Pokemon only takes damage from attacks. And then we got Heavy Metal, the Metagross, holding the Shell Bell. That is an item that we got in Heart Home City after I did some exploring with the ability Heat Proof. Weakens the power of fire type moves, and with the moveset of Magnet Bomb, Iron Head, Iron Tail, and Flash Cannon. And then finally, finally, Danny, the Glaceon, with Ice Fang, Icy Wind, Rage, and Crush Claw, as I just said about a minute ago, with Sand Bell. So this is our team for now. Uh, let's go heal up and uh, cut away again. And right here in the Pokemon Center, if we talk to you, we're doing news piece on trainers. Can we ask you to participate? Uh, we want to see how strong you are in a battle. And let's see. Let's get Danny right in action with a Leyron. Okay, this is not the best Pokemon to, to, to battle a Leyron. Uh, Manny. Magnet Bomb. hey -oh! Earthquake will take this down, no problem. And let's see what the next Pokemon is. Hopefully we can get Danny uh, back in battle. A Jirachi. Okay, so no. 
No, 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 no. Um, we will just keep Manny in for an earthquake. Hopefully, you don't have Levitate, Jirachi. Reflect will take a couple of earthquakes, probably. It looks like it'll take two. Let's just imprison. Won't do anything. Another earthquake will take it down. And one more. I don't know why you're doing a light screen. Kind of a useless Jirachi right there. And Manny got to level 27. You want to learn Dig. Um... Honestly, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna replace dig with magnitude just because magnitude is kind of hit or miss. If we have like a low magnitude, it won't do a lot of damage. And you know, you never know if you're gonna get magnitude seven, eight, nine, or ten, you know. So that that's why we're gonna teach Manny Dig. And if we battle you, uh, we can also take this guy on. And you have a Kingdra. Uh Ice Fang. Shockwave. Ooh, okay. Uh, that doesn't do anything. Yikes. Um, what can we do to take down a Kingdra? Greta, get out here. Dragon Dance. Uh-oh. Muddy Water. Won't do anything. Leaf Blade should take it out. Leaf Blade should take it out. Perfect. Nice job, Greta. And level 26. All right, what's up? What's up? A Hunt Tail. Um, let's actually switch to Shane because you actually do have uh, useful moves. Huntail. Let's go with Thunderbolt. Super effective. Rain Dance, you're only helping the cause, buddy. Thunderbolt, take it down. Nice job, Shane. Great battle debut. And you want to learn Sonic Boom. Hmm. Special attack to foe with the Destructive Shock. Always inflicts 20 HP. Uh, we'll hold off on that. I know it is special, but I mean, I like our moveset right now. So. All right, all right, and we took down the cameraman, so now let's just heal up again real quickly because we are right here, might as well. And then let's go into the gym, but before we can battle the gym leader, actually, we need to go into the contest hall. And, oh, Kira, oh, my hero. Oh, hi, Tanidi. Hey, mom. Wait, no, really? Johanna is your mom? So you might be a contest star? Oh, I don't know about that. I've never spoken to Timmy B about contests before. I'm surprised that you know each other, though. Oh, yes, that's right. I need to thank you for earlier. Please take this accessory. And we got the glitter powder. Yay. And then this is just uh, regular chit-chat. Mom's going to tell us something. Were you surprised to see me, Timmy B? I got bored, so I came out of heart home for vacation. I'm just as surprised to see you here, my dear. Blah, blah, blah. Contest, contest. Yay. Uh, we got a tuxedo. Hey, now we're actually going to look pretty fly. Bye, Mom. That was great talk. Thanks for the tuxedo. And if we just talk to you, uh, you are the gym leader. So we will see you in the gym. And we are in the gym. This is a little bit of a tough puzzle. Basically, we need to read this blue tile, which is a triangle. And now we need to find the door with a triangle, which is this one. Okay, perfect. So basically, we need to find the blue tiles. And I think the other one is over here. And we need to match it to the door. Um... Let's actually battle this trainer to see what type of gym it is, just in case we do need a grind. I believe Manny got to level 27, which would be um, right there, Tangela. So this is either a grass or poison type gym again. So my guess would be grass. You're taking in for solar beam, but Danny will be able to take a solar beam. All right, maybe not, but Ice Fang will, t uh, you really you got a super potion? Safeguard, okay. Level 21 for Danny and a victory bell. Okay, that doesn't really help either. Um, <laughs> we really don't have anything, so let's just bring in heavy metal to take this down. So this is going to be a grass or poison type gym. Since gym 2 was grass, or I'm sorry, poison, I would assume that this would be grass. But, you know, hey, you never know with the randomization. So let's, let's actually just battle you. Whoa, I did not heal up Danny. That's fine, we, we can switch, we can switch. Another victory bell that also doesn't help. Okay, great. Can we can we just get a single type Pokemon, please? Danny can't be switched out. Oh no, Are we about to lose Danny already. Let's use uh let's use a super potion. Let's heal up Danny at least. Sludge bomb. Oh that oh that does a lot. Oh no 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 no. I do not want to lose Danny. But I'm also out of items. Pretty much. Citrus Berry, help us. Toxic Spikes. Okay, we can at least live for a little bit. Sludge Bomb! And we froze. We froze. Perfect. 
Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah. Awesome, Danny. Thank you so much. And a Cradilly. Okay, so this is a Grass Gym uh, Cradilly. You always give us some trouble. So let's switch to Heavy Metal for some heavy hits. Iron Head. Yep, critical hit. Super effective. Perfect. Okay. Okay, let's go heal up and then uh, we will cut back. Okay, guys, and we are just going to cut back to when we get to the gym leader because that puzzle was uh, a lot harder than I thought and it took way too much time. But we got Danny up to level 23 and it learned uh, Avalanche. But Icy Wind is probably going to be our best bet. It is a little bit inaccurate, but it is a special attack. So look at that. Um, so we have Danny out front. Um, we are going to be a little bit under, not under leveled a little bit, but let's just go ahead and just battle. Why not? Enough of me talking. Let's battle. Fantina, what is up? Okay. Three Pokemon. The first one will be a Carnivine. Okay. So, Danny, Danny should be able to take this down. Yo, and you have Snow Warning? That only helps us. <laughs> Let's go for the Icy Wind and see how much damage we can do. Okay, perfect. And we lowered the special defense, or speed, I'm sorry. Brave Bird! Yo, I am not a fan of Brave Bird. Also, why do you have Brave Brave, Brave Bird? You are a plant. Hail continues to fall. Does Hail take this out by chance? No. Uh, let's go for another Icy Wind. You're definitely going to heal up. Yep. And let's just do another Icy Wind. Let's see what... This should be able to take it out, right? No. Okay. Super effective. Uh, speed is down again. Hail continues to fall. Does this hail take you out? No. All right, let's just go for the Ice Fang just to be safe. It won't heal up again. And Danny will be getting to level 24, which is what I like to see. Danny grew to level 24. Perfect. And defense and special defense are, like, pretty good. So, like, we can take a hit or two, but let's see if there's a powerful Pokemon coming. Hail continues to fall. I am a fan of this hail uh, being an ice type. A Tangela. Um, we're going to keep Danny in. Tangela should be fine. Tangela will be level 26. Okay, this is her This is her big Pokemon, so we'll be holding a Citrus Berry, but hopefully this Icy Wind takes it out. Come on. And it does. Nice job, Danny. What a team player. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, I like this. I like Danny. And what's going to be your final Pokemon? A Venusaur. Um. Hmm. Let's let's go with Heavy Metal. Hmm. Let's just go with Heavy Metal. I think Danny would be able to take it down, but you never know. Venusaur could have some powerful, powerful moves. So let's just um, brute force this down. And it's nice that a poison move wouldn't be able to hit us, which is always nice. So let's go with the Iron Head and see if we can get the flinch. How much damage does that do? Okay, just enough. And you did flinch. Okay, perfect. Hail continues to fall. We will get uh, hit a little bit with the uh, Hail. We do have the Shell Bell as well. And you shouldn't heal right now. Unless you do, but no worries. Yep, and Iron Head hits. And we get our third Gym Badge. Okay, okay. That would have definitely been a little bit of a scarier battle if we didn't have that ice type because, as you can tell, we are very, very weak to to grass and poison. But we finally got a Pokemon that can, can cover that. And I am dumbfounded. So very, very strong. Power is adorable, blah, blah, blah. We get the Relic Badge. And it's time to spin the Gift Wheel, everybody. So we got the Gift Wheel again. We can use Defog outside of battle. And we get TM65. Let's see what we got here. It contains Flash. So we get Defog. Or we don't get Defog. But we can use Defog and now Flash. So uh, we definitely won't be learning Flash probably. But now it's time to spin the Gift Wheel. And let's see what our challenge or reward is. And we get a new phone. So a new phone. Okay. So right now it's a second attempt if we black out in battle. So we're just going to ignore that. We aren't going to do anything. Um, but it's nice that we don't get challenge or reward, or not challenge or rewarded. I would love a reward. But uh, new phone, if you want to give me a new phone, um, I would greatly appreciate that. So let's uh, cut back to, actually, no, we'll, 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 we'll lament in this victory on our way back to the Pokemon Center to heal up. 
but yeah, so if you have a new gift suggestion, especially for a new phone, because blacking out in battle means we lose the Nuzlocke. I don't know what I was thinking when I was creating this list. I must have been must have been late at night for me. So if you have a new gift or a new gift idea for a new phone, put it in the comments. It is greatly appreciated. Okay. Now we're going to cut away. Bye-bye. And hello again, everybody. And we are going to head to Route 209 and Salacion Town. Or Salacion Town. I guess however you want to pronounce it. And looks like... Ooh. Okay. Our friend the Grinch is here. Ta-da! Kept me waiting again, Timmy B. Let's see how much tougher you and I have gotten right here and right now. Hey, you're a trainer now. You're expected to be ready for battle. No whining. No waiting. Let's get started and let's get the show on. So we're going to be battling our rival Grinch. He will have four Pokemon, and let's see what the first one is. The first one is a Luxray. I have Shane out front, and that is a bad Pokemon to have Shane out in front. So let's switch to... We'll just switch to Manny. I mean, Manny. Manny's, you know, kind of close to being overleveled. And you got Speed Boost. Oh, you withdrew Luxray. Okay, Grinch is getting uh, pretty smart now, and you're switching to a Jolteon for no reason. Okay. So, Earthquake will be taking <laughs> taking Jolteon out. That was a kind of a pointless switch, but hey, whatever. Let's see what's coming up next. A Growlithe. Okay, uh, oh yeah, this is a starter with Drizzle. So, Tammy! Time to get out here, Tammy. Level 27, and you still have Drizzle. So, let's uh, use some Water Pulse and take this out in not one, but two hits. Sunny Day. Okay, at least you got that going for you. Uh, Sunny Day shouldn't affect Water Pulse too, too much, but it will take it out. It's super effective, and Tammy keeps on trucking. Sunlight is strong, and back to the Luxray, so we're going to go back to Manny. I don't know why you would switch out, especially with Speed Boost, but what, what are you doing? And now you're switching to a Magneton, so Earthquake... Okay. All right, so Manny is... Uh, Manny could just run through this whole team with the Grinch. Manny to level 28, and a Luxray. I don't know why, like, you must not have a single move on it. Do you have Accupressure? Okay, that's, uh... Okay, Sunlight is strong. Speed Boost. Accupressure. Defense sharply rose. Okay, are you gonna... Accupressure, this must be your only move, right? Alright, whatever. And we took down the Grinch. You know what? I'm not even going to... He's going to talk to us something. I, I don't know. Whatever. Now it's time to get another encounter, potentially, for Route 209. If we go into the grass here, there is an item up here. And let's see what our encounter is. We have... What? No way! Oh my god, Deoxys? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah. But we gotta ask Santa, are we naughty or are we nice? We've been nice two times for legendary encounters, and this time we are naughty. So unfortunately, we cannot catch the Deoxys. So, um, that sucks. But then again, I also only have Pokeballs, I think. So I don't know how, like, good it would have been. Uh, let me just check. I have a couple netballs. Yeah, that, that wouldn't do anything. All right, so guys, we can't catch the Deoxys. I don't know if we would have caught it anyways, but dang, that is uh, super bumped out. And we found an insect plate. That would have been nice if we had a bug Pokemon on the team. And now we got a bunch of trainers, so let's uh, go ahead and battle you, my friend. A Zatu. Oh, this is perfect for Shane. Thunderbolt this Zatu down. Yeah, nice job, Shane. A Gallade. Uh, mm -hmm. What should we do for a Gallade, guys? Let's actually get Greta. We haven't seen Greta too much today, except for at, at the beginning when we were evolving, Shane. So let's, uh, frustration, yo. Okay, take it out, Leaf Blade. Thank you, Critical Leaf Blade. Hooray. Hypno. Hypno. Hypno, Hypno, Hypno. Heavy Metal. Let's just get a full team going on right now. Uh, let's Iron Head this bad boy down. Takes it out. Level 26 for Heavy Metal. Love to see that. And a Clay Doll. Uh, Tammy would be nice. Tammy would be nice. Let's go into Danny, actually, because any ground move would probably take 
uh, Tammy out. So let's use Danny for an icy win. Speed lower, Earth power. Won't do anything. Special defense goes down. One more icy win. Takes it out for the win. And we took down Pokemon Breeder Albert. Love to see that. Love, love, love to see that. And if we talk to this guy, he will give us the good rod. So I, th I, I think we should use it, right? Oh, uh, yeah, I know how to fish. Sure. So I think we should be able to, to at least get this fishing encounter right here. Uh, you're just a jogger. He's not a trainer. He just jogs every morning. So let's use the good rod. Let's at least try once or twice to see if we can catch anything. If we can't, uh, no worries. Not even a nibble. Okay, let's try Let's try just uh, a couple more times to see if we can get an encounter. I think this is the perfect fishing spot right here. Come on. Reeled it in too quickly. Okay, not not the best fisherman on my side of the family, I will admit. Oh, landed a Pokemon. Let's see what we got here. A Togepi. Okay, well. Santa. Are we naughty? Or are we nice? And we are naughty. I think I jinxed myself. Uh, last episode because I was like we're finally nice we were three out of four for nice encounters uh, but this time we are naughty we can't naughty excuse me we can't catch the Togepi and uh, how is our team doing uh, Greta looks like you need a super potion so we'll get you healed up before this battle uh, or the next couple of battles why did I hit cancel why did I hit cancel actually we'll give Danny, Danny a super potion too better safe than sorry all right, now let's continue on. And we got a double battle, so let's have... Yeah, let's have Shane and Danny. Let's get the new two team members involved. Hopefully this uh, doesn't come to bite me. <laughs> and let's see what we got. A Smeargle and a Ur Ursaring. Okay. Um, Let's go with a Thunderbolt on Ursaring. And we will do the Icy Wind on both of them. That makes sense. Let's see what we got. Critical hit on Smeargle. Smeargle goes down. Ursaring survives. Okay. You use Hal, so your attack will be raised. Not a problem. Thunderbolt again, and just Icy Wind because it's fun. Nice job, Shane and Danny. All right. Shane grew to level 23. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, oh, there's me saying perfect again. I'm sorry, everybody. We got some berries right here. Let's see what we got. A Lepa Berry. Yum, yum, yum. And I believe these look like Oren berries. Chesto berries. Okay, so if we do fall asleep, that's actually not, not, not a bad berry to have on the team. And we have a couple more trainers. I believe we have an item right here. So let's see what we got. A shoal shop. Shoal salt. <laughs> Excuse me. And we got a, a Pikachu here. Hi, hi. I'm a Pokemon. Is this a static encounter or... Oh, no, it's a trainer. Poke Kid Danielle. With the Latios! Yup, what? Okay, um... Let's just go into Manny because you are our strongest Pokemon right now. More than likely. Dragon Claw won't do anything. How about an Earth? Bullet Seed is good. Uh, stop! Ah, come on. Uh... Just don't do Bullet Seed again? Dragon Claw? Okay, perfect. Woof! All right, so the Pikachu Poke Kid Danielle had a Latios. Okay, that is good to know. Noted. And if we continue along this way, looks like we have a battle with you. Please let me battle the Pokemon you've raised. Okay, sure. You have a seal. Uh, that's actually perfect for Shane. We will Thunderbolt you down. And a horsey. Oh, this could be a Shane sweep. Thunderbolt takes you down, Horsey. Level 24. You want to learn Horn Attack. Um, It's a physical, but honestly, it just gives us a little bit more type coverage and it's more accurate than... So let's just, let's just learn Horn Attack. You never know. You never know. Slow Bro, we'll be able to take this down with a Thunderbolt. Okay, we will be able to take it down with two Thunderbolts. And a Wingle. <laughs> Thunderbolt. <laughs> ha 
and Shane is uh, cruising right now. And again, this is just a jogger. He's just like, I like jogging. I don't know. Do you, do you guys like running? Put it in the context. I tried to get into it at the beginning of this. Uh, ooh, antidote. Okay, nice. I tried to get running uh, at the beginning of this, and then I was like, you know what? I can find cardio in like much better ways, such as you know basketball. Uh, that that's a rock. Okay. This there is a broken, crumbling tower made of stone. There seems to be a spot that would be perfect fit for the old odd keystone. Would you like to use the odd keystone? I sure would. The tower has been restored. Hallowed tower is written. Uh, if we did something in the underground, we would have been able to uh, get. Is, is there an item down there? Nope. Okay, I'm just seeing things. Okay. And ooh, let's hop. Oh, let's get these berries first, and then like we'll hop on. There's an item up there. I see that in the top right. What's up there? Item. I'll get you as soon as I can. And we're still on Route 209, right? Because this would not be a new encounter. I think that's right. So let's hop on our bike. Whee! Oh, trainer. Say, honey, where'd you come from? What kinds of Pokemon are you with? You're about to find out. I got Shane the Kadabra. You got a Dialga. Okay, okay. Dialga? Dialga's scary. Dialga's scary. So, uh, Manny, just, just come back in here and we'll earthquake you down. Metal sound. My special defense fell, but Gyro Ball. Okay, that doesn't do anything. That's the worst part about, like, Nuzlocke and, like, Legendaries is that grudge is that every time like they they use an attack i'm like yo this is gonna take me out shane grew to level 25 though which is always nice and manny got to level 29 Whew. but yeah i think that's like one of the worst parts about nuzlocke challenges is like no matter what almost every single time i face a legendary and they use an attack i'm like i'm done it's like i'm done uh there is absolutely no way we can bike on this right that that would take too many skills that kill and we got another double battle. Let's just make sure Shane is all ready to go. I think I think you are, Shane. So please just don't have a couple of legendaries. As we got a double battle. Oh my god. I really need to... Seriously? Seriously, guys? Seriously? Um. Oh my god. Uh, la, 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 la. we're gonna switch Shane for heavy metal because you can take some hits and deliver some hits and let's just see what Icy Wind does especially on the Lugia being part flying let's just see what Lugia does U-turn Psycho Boost see what I mean see what I mean every time a legend oh really Ooh. Um, let's take out the Lugia. And we are going to switch you for... Ugh, yikes. Manny. Thunder Punch. Okay, good. That was a good switch. Iron Head. And we got the Flinch. So we're going to Iron Head. Iron Head, excuse me, on the Lugia again. And... Uh, let's just go for judgment on the Deoxys. Thunder Punch! And we're paralyzed. Of course we are. But Lugia goes out. Okay. Whew. What does judgment do? Okay, that's good. Um, We are just going to heal, heal up on Heavy Metal. And Manny will judgment again. U-turn won't do anything. Perfect. Okay, that was that was a scary battle. This is the uh, Root of Legends, apparently. So, very, very scary. This is the Lost Tower, and once we get Defog, we'll hop in there. Just because in the fog, you, you can really miss some attacks, and I want to make sure that I can hit every single attack that I can. So, we'll get that encounter once we get the HM for Defog. And we made it to Silesian Town. And he'll battle us another time. It was always nice seeing Grinch. And uh, let's heal up. <laughs> and I think that that honestly might end the episode. Let's go talk to that guy by the Lost Tower to see if he is a trainer. Because I think that would be uh, fun to battle. So let's see if we can end the episode with a, uh, a much easier battle. If that is the case. We do have some berries right there. Which is very nice. Yeah, Route 209, it's the same. 
uh, departed Pokemon sleep in the Lost Tower, but if we cut down this tree from Shane, we can get this item and let's see what we got. TM85 Psybeam! Yo, that's going on Shane. That is definitely going on Shane. And, yeah, guys, uh, just looking at the time now, it seems like we are right around time, so that's going to end the episode. We made it all the way to Salacion Town. We will explore this next episode, get some more encounters. We will take down the Lost Tower, battle some more trainers, hopefully without legendaries. But we got our third gym badge, so we are cruising along this randomized Sandalock. And if you guys would, hit that thumbs up button to like this video. And then subscribe to the channel. It's really cool. It's really fun. I'm an awesome guy. At least I think I am. Uh, but yeah, and then, you know, put whatever you want in the comments. Say hello. Say bye. Say hello again. You know, do whatever you guys want. Have a great day. I'll see you soon.